This is Steve Pistillo from P2 Automation, and in this short video, I want to show you an interesting tool on the Microsoft.com website, probably the, what I consider the best kept secret on the Microsoft website, uh, a quick tool for showing you some of the commands in either Office 2007 or Office 2010 for those of you who are still using Office 2003. Um, as you know, the interface completely changed from Office 2003 to 2007, and many people I still talk to today find it frustrating to um, go from the old version to the new version. So there's a great tool out there, and I created a, a bit.ly for you just to shorten it up. Um, bit.ly slash BA4K5Z. And if you go to this site, it'll bring you to the um, a place on the Office website or the Microsoft website where you can transition to the Office ribbon. And what it is down here, if you scroll down, there's some interactive guides for either Office 2010 or Office 2007. And I'll show you the 2010 version. And I'll start with something simple like Word. When you start this program, it's going to start this interactive guide, and you're going to land on a page that looks just like Word 2003. Just click the Start button here, and it's very simple to use. If you know a command in Word 2003, all you have to do is pick it. So let's start with something simple like Print. File Print, everybody remembers that. And what happens is the screen switches to 2010, and it shows you where to go in the new 2010. File Print. Try another command. Um, file Page Setup, that's another one that is no longer in the File menu. So if you go to File Page Setup, screen flips over, it tells you to go to the Page Layout tab, and all your commands for margins and whatnot are found there. Um, everything works the same in the Excel version, the PowerPoint version, and the Outlook version. Uh, so give it a shot.